If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. Fuck you. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. Eat shit. If you're happy and you know it, then your face will surely show it. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. Dumb cunt. Can't believe we didn't find God in Jerusalem. Well, we'll have to keep looking. Oh, here's our bus to the airport. <laughs> wow, that was super loud. Oh man, this toothpick is the best! I'm not going anywhere without it. Like Batman and his futility belt. I can't get these locks open. Don't you have something in your belt? Oh yeah, maybe. Let's see. I have some hockey trading cards, a post-it with some hair stuck to the edge, something that might be a roll aid. I don't know, it's just loose. Hurry, it's getting closer! I have some stamps. Oh, you know what? It's a cir- Now, I've been trying to figure out something we can do together, and I think I've found it. We're gonna sing a song. Now, I'll start, and when I point to you, you'll sing your part. Ready? War! Uh. Yeah! What is it good for? Absolutely nothing! Okay, all right, good job. Now, let's try something else. I wanna get you home and uh. double up. Uh. Uh. Okay, I like where this is going. Let's take it from the top. I like big butts, and I cannot lie. Ah, I was aiming for the church. God angry now! Ay, 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 ay! Good evening, I'm Tom Tucker. Coming up, a boom shadow from the sound guy we can't fire because his wife died. There it is. But first, Quahog says goodbye to an old friend. Oh my god, I just got four more matches! This is amazing! This is the greatest invention since the firecracker! Gentlemen, after many years of research, we finally did it. We've solved the problem of too many fingers in Florida. Okay, kids, we're gonna start practice as soon as I get that guy out of here. I'm 60 yards away! <sighs> All right, I, I guess if a loose ball goes over there, just don't go. That was amazing! I can drive! Now I can do a slow cruise past my ex-girlfriend's apartment. 11.45 and the lights are on. Doing it with the lights on now, whore! Don't mind looking at his body! I love you so much, though. Congratulations, you're caller number five. You're going to see Justin Bieber. Oh, sweet Jesus. Yes, Jesse, I won. Never say never. Oh, that was awkward. Like a stranger trying to make conversation. Long line, huh? There's two of us. Reminds me of that Steinfeld episode. No sauce for you, <laughs> right? You missed both of them. I can't believe that show's still on. It's not. I really like that Julia Richard Dreyfus, though. Ugh. Mr. Sanders, thank you for waiting. Here's the medicine for your brain injury. Oh, now I feel bad. I know, it's great. And with all the time Brian is saving me, I've been able to spend more time working with my foundation that gives impoverished nations things they don't want or need. All right, let's get this stuff out fast, guys. These people have nothing. All right, everybody gets a hot dog toaster and a special zigzag brownie pan so that every brownie you bake has a chewy edge. We got 300,000 Harlequin costumes and 500,000 sets of stairs that a dog can use to get up on a bed. Well, looking around, I can see everybody looks kind of thirsty, so each of you gets a Crash Bandicoot video game. All right, I'll see you guys next month, because I got a shipment coming in of those realistic testicles you hang off the back of your truck. Also, you can have my penis enlarging machine. It's in my closet. Ah, uh, did you look? Will you, will you text me if you looked? Lewis! 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 Mom! 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 Mommy! 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 Mama! 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 Ma! 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 Mom! 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 Mommy! Mommy! Mama! 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 What? Hi. <laughs> you can do something different and creative. Really? What about being a pilot? Eh, it's just not a challenge anymore. These days the autopilot does everything. Can I get you anything, Captain? You can get me some of this, toots. <gasps> okay, I guess I'll just sit here and read a fucking magazine. Well, hang on, Lois. You promised me we were all eating my Play-Doh pasta tonight. Oh, Stewie, did you make something? Mmm. Oh, it's so yummy. Mmm. Nom, 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 nom. You better mean those nums. Yeah, whatever you're doing, it's working. You should see the way I have to pick up chicks. Hi. <laughs> Hi, Crest. Hey.
there's my big smart son, my special guy, my Chrissy. Sounds like someone got her vibrator working again. What's going on over there? Looks like a student rally. They probably forgot to study for an exam, so they organized a protest. In the 90s, you just pull a fire alarm. Now you hold a protest. That is, when they're not looking down at their phones. Well, Lois, I happen to be a Muslim now, which means I'll be spending a lot of my time in mostly empty cafes watching soccer on an 8-inch black and white TV. Peter, this is my friend Omar. He can teach you many things about our faith, including how to ululate. What's that? It's this. Oh my god, that's terrifying. I, I don't know if I'm ready for that. No, Peter, it's okay. Just sing the beginning of La Bamba, but don't say the La Bamba part. Oh, okay. La, 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 yes, good job. La, la, You're doing la, la, it. Bamba. Ooh, so close. What are you talking about? I'm talking about Mahmood. You know, I actually feel really bad for him. Do you know he knew 19 guys who died on 9-11? I mean, what are the odds? Peter, I think you joined a terrorist sleeper cell. I'm going to call Mahmood right now on this cell phone he gave me. He'll tell you. Damn phone's busted. I'll drive! <laughs> Okay, you're good to go. We'll go celebrate at the clam. That's a great idea. Yeah, I think we could all use a drink. Tell you what, let me call Horace and tell him to get our table ready. Peter, did you just... Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Stupid name. And nobody likes you at school. You're going to be ugly when you grow up. And everything in your house is cheap. And it smells in here. Oh, hey, Brian. Bye. As a mom, I want my kids to start their day right. And there's no better way than with a glass of fresh squeezed Sunny Dale orange juice. Isn't that right, sweetie? Shut your hole, bitch. I'll tell you what I want fresh squeezed. These. Ah! Oh, here's what I think of this orange juice. I can't, I can't, I can't go right now with everybody watching. But, but I presume you understand the disrespect I intended. You're welcome. <laughs> oh, cool shell. Hey, I was thinking of heading down the river. You want to go halfsies on a raft? Sure, but can you spot me? I've never been paid, ever. Yeah, I got it. Okay, it says Armin is arriving with our raft right now. You, Huckleberry? All right, Lenny, this looks good. Now, the trick to getting off a moving train is waiting for the exact right... Ow! Whew. Now I know why that railroad was called the B and O. It stands for Baltimore and Ohio. Whoa, calm down. No, mental detectives know a lot about trains. So glad you're here. I really need to pee. Go ahead. I'll handle the kids. No, you need to come with me. The toilets are all like one foot off the ground, so I need to hold on to your arm while I lower myself down. Yeah, I'm not doing that. Boy, you guys sure packed a lot of stuff. Yeah, well, we're gonna be gone a week. Me, I travel light. Just two shirts, two pairs of pants, and the machine that does the work of my large intestine. We brought a machine that gives Lois orgasms. <sighs> what is in here? The soap, the little tray the soap was on, and the sink. We now return to CNN's continuing coverage of the rescue of Guy Fieri's toilet.
What you're looking at is live footage from Guy Fieri's house where this toilet's 12-year ordeal has just come to an end. Toilet, what was it like after he ate those dragon chili cheese fries? Look, I can't talk right now. I just need to get something solid in me for once. Whoa, Stewie, you're getting to be a big boy. I think somebody's going to be a football star. Oh, you. Oh, forgot your chart. Be right back. Whoa, Jason, you're getting to be a big boy. I think somebody's going to be a football star. Can't believe I fell for that line. I actually let myself believe I could be a doctor's wife. You're just fat, Stewie. Silly and fat. I'm not going to no Jewish school. Sitting around all day with a bunch of short, hairy guys, I'll feel like I'm on the forest moon of Endor. Didn't you... Didn't you make that joke the other day? Oh, yeah. No, I, I just... I wasn't sure if everybody had, um... Had heard. That truck's coming up on us awful fast. Holy crap! Do you see what I see? I'm afraid I do. We're being chased by ghosts! Oh, come on. It's not that bad. Your life could be worse. You could be a black... A black... Go ahead. A blanket. I'm just a stupid old blanket. What a lousy life this is. All right, you saved it. I had a wedding. Oh, you look beautiful. And he's a handsome fella, ain't he? Well, I am ready for my evening. Oh, my God, Peter. What the hell? Peter, what are you doing? Oh, surely, Jerome, you don't want to stay in the same house as a ghost who carries a torch around. Oh, fire ghost. Oh, you scared yet? Didn't know this place was haunted, did you? <laughs> okay, nobody move. Oh, my God, those guys in first class have guns. Cleveland, just be happy with what you have. Don't envy people. Died not 30 minutes ago in the carriage on the way here. <gasps> well, we all know how this goes. I'm doing it. Hey, Lois, I'd like you to meet our new friend. Jerome? Loose Lois. What? You guys know each other? Know each other? Peter, Jerome is an old boyfriend of mine. What? Oh, sorry I was out of it. Wait, are we being robbed? Ah! Ah! My ass? Man, this trip is dangerous. Couldn't we have just taken a bus? <laughs> no, it's a black guy. Oh, a message from Joe. Hey, Cleveland, I just wanted to give you a heads up that Peter has a whip because, well, you know, given your racial heritage, it seems like something you might want to keep an eye out for. Grape soda, Graham. I know this is very risky, but the upside is so good, I'm taking it. Lois, to show I'm in touch with what it's like to be African-American, I am going to go to the middle of the town square, get naked, and paint myself brown. No, no, that's offensive. You can't pretend to be black. That's a stupid idea. What? It's a stupid idea! You're a stupid man! A stupid, stupid man! Ow! You're hurting me! Stop it! Stop it, Lois! No! I'm so sick of your crap! Why do you always do these stupid things? And why do you always announce them to me before you do them? Are you trying to get a rise out of me? Has 9-11 changed everything, Brian? 9-11 changed everything. Peter, you didn't even know what 9-11 was until 2004. That's not true, Brian. I remember 9-11. <laughs> Must have been a woman pilot, eh? Oh, damn. I say, I seem to have sewn a shoe to my hand. May I go to the nurse? Replace him! Ah! Ah! The pathway to enlightenment starts with an unfettered, focused mind. Look out! Ah! What are you doing? Oh. oh, I thought that dot on your head was from a sniper rifle. Do you think all those chickens had to buy tickets? I don't know, but I'm starving. What I wouldn't give right now for a big, juicy steak. How dare you! To us, cows are sacred! That's right! You are disrespecting our entire culture! And why did Wes Anderson come here to make his worst movie? Stewie, what do we do? Quick, hit the red buttons! <sighs> wow, that came in handy. Yeah, now let's, let's get out of here. Wieners look like. Yeah, yeah, no, let's get out of here. Peter, 
This spot is a sacred adornment. It's a portal, an opening through which all light, goodness, rejuvenation, joy, and ecstasy may enter the human form. A vagina? Get out! You know, it actually looks like the Native Americans have done all right for themselves. They do seem to have a lot of shops. And it looks like they have medical care as well. Ma'am, I'm sorry, but I've done this several times today, and your husband just isn't responding. Well, have you tried this? Ma'am, this is a place of medicine. And their popular music is interesting. And here it is, the number one song for the 10,000th week in a row. Hiya, hiya, hiya. Hiya, 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 hiya. Ireland was a much different place before the discovery of alcohol. Most experts believe it was something like this. Gentlemen, today we Ireland's top scientists have found a way to convert our entire population to pure energy. Oh, oh, glorious glorious day. Day. Absolutely. Hey, Michael McLeod's just invented a new kind of beverage in his basement. Hmm, whiskey. <laughs> yeah, you're <laughs> All right, here's one. So, a horse walks into a bar and the bartender says, Why the long face? <laughs> <laughs> That's hilarious. Hey, screw you. Whoa! What the hell's your problem? You're my problem, dude. That joke is offensive. Oh, yeah? Yeah, I'm sorry that not everyone conforms to your preconceived notions of attractiveness. It's a joke, man. Oh, oh, yeah? Oh, it's a joke? How about this? Why are there so few black baseball players? Why? Because they're always stealing bases. Ha 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 ha! Whoa! Hey, now that is offensive. Yeah, what the hell, man? Hey, it's a joke, man. Yeah, but it's racist. Oh, the horse with a long face just told a racist joke, huh? Yeah, that's different. Oh, yeah, how's it different? Hey, why do you have so many drinks and you haven't touched any of them? Uh, hello, Einstein. Hooves. No freaking thumbs. Can't pick up a glass. Well, then why are you in a bar? Bite me, that's why, douchebag. Look, look, I think we all got off on the wrong foot here. Yeah, well, you got that right. We're sorry, okay? All right, me too. Look. I'm Mike, and this is Harry. Sarah Jessica Parker. This van has the latest in law enforcement technology. Watch. Suspect! Suspect! You have the right to remain silent. <laughs> Sweet. Hey, let me try. Cleveland, don't! Minority suspect! Minority suspect! Danger! He's got a gun! Ow! 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 Ah, dang it! Do you have any idea how fast you were going, sir? Peter? Hey, Cleveland, this is just so we can talk without getting spotted by Lois and Donna. I need you to step out of the car, sir. Peter, there's got to be a better way. He's got a knife! Ow, 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 ow. Sorry, Cleveland, it's got to be authentic. Stay down! Ow. Stay down! Ow. Cleveland, try to grab my gun. Oh, trying to grab my gun, are you? Ow. Ow. Hey, rookie, save some for me. Wow, the whole gang's back together. Just shut up. We don't need you in this town. Ow! Tell you what, let me call Horace and tell him to get our table ready. Peter, did you just... Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh, God, there's four. Please don't free the slaves. It's a bad idea. They'll try to get back at us, and that's our biggest fear. Allahu Akbar! Ugh, my allergies. And everything else. Just terrible. Choo, choo. All right, let's go. What should we leave for a tip? The food and service were both great. Give them the full 3%. Cheap, cheap, cheap. Choo, cheap, choo. This is why I hate going outside. <laughs> that was hilarious. And again, the global community's inaction during the Holocaust was unforgivable. Hey, Dale. I noticed your lawn's getting a little high. Yeah, I used to have a guy for that. Dick. Okay, now, you have a good one. And this much tension when the slaves were freed. Uh, okay, so, uh, you're free to go. But we're cool, right? What? Say the word? Right now? Yeah, together. Ready? You bet. <gasps> you could have just quit the show. We're not the first people to be dragged off against our will. Are we there yet? No. Are we there yet? No. Are we there yet? Damn it, I swear to God, I will turn this ship around. That works. Okay. Can we teach us a lesson? Yeah, that's even better. All right, if that's what you... Wait a minute! Now return to... Damn, nature, you scary! 
on BET. Damn, that motherfucker run fast. You see that shit? That thing come by my house, I kill it. Was anybody gonna wake me up for the party? It's 6.30, I went down at noon. Now I'm gonna be up all night watching bad reality TV. We now return to Uber driver Ninja Warrior. First, he's got to swing on the gold chains across the cologne bath without dropping his e-cigarette. Next, he's got to pick up a rideshare customer. Now he's going to be late, but he's going to make it seem like the passenger's fault and not his. Where the hell have you been? I've been here, man. Maybe you press wrong button. I don't know. Now don't talk to me. I'm on four different phone calls. <laughs> What's wrong with you? Why are you acting like such a bully? Because there are two kinds of people in this world, Chris. There are bullies and there are nerds. And there are hot Asian chicks. They'll do what you want. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. You better believe it, buddy. They will do what you want. Because they know. They know what you want. Oh, 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 don't be afraid. Don't be afraid. I won't hurt you. I won't hurt you. Me, big American man. My point being that I'm a bully, not a nerd. Now, where was I? Oh, yeah. Dad! Get away from me! Uh-oh, Peter's fired, you're coming to get you! Peter's fired, you're coming to get you! Here comes Peter's fired, you're coming to get you! Oh, in the kitchen, Meg! Hey. Meg! What the hell are you doing in here? Shower time. Yeah, for me! Not, not for... What are you doing with that loofah? Don't worry about it. You told me not to worry about it! I should have been worried the whole time! Uh, 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 hold it, hold it. What, what? What's going on here? I'm pregnant. You... you're what? Yeah. We're in the middle of a thing here. Well, you didn't return any of my texts. So, what, what, so what's going on? You, you, you want, like, a, a ride to the place? Peter, what's going on? What's going on, Lois, is that this girl is obviously not well. And I have just learned that she's been stealing from the show and she should probably be escorted out of the building. Yeah, yeah, family guy! Yes, well, if they want to make me into a monster like those people, we'll give them a monster. Like when Godzilla attacked Haiti. Oh, my God. You're right, Lois. I shouldn't be bullying the people I care about. I should be bullying Randy Fulcher. He's the jerk in all this. Like Dick Cheney when he was a Walmart greeter. Go f*** yourself. Go f*** yourself. Go f*** yourself. You see, if our guests insist on bringing prostitutes into our B&B, we might as well provide the women, too. What? Stewie, we're not going to become pimps. Are you sure? I'm sure. The answer is no, so don't bother flashing a wad of money because there's no way I'm going to change my answer in the middle of this sentence. Okay, maybe we could try it out and see how it goes. Hey, what are you girls doing standing around? Get to work! <laughs> I'm telling you, that dog is very easily persuaded. Now let's see what's going on at the old high school. <laughs> Is that true, Dad? Yeah, truth is, I don't know nothing about this place. I don't even know why it's called Nepal. The mountains look like nipples. Well, you can't just call a country nipples. What about Nepal? Ooh, I like that. Ha, huh, shocker. God gets it right. Ah, oh, I did it! I'm back! Oh, damn it, I left my chapstick in the past. Chapstick. With smooth lips, I will finally be able to be a mayor who kisses babies with confidence. Hey, cracked lips! You'll see. You'll all see. This is the worst day of my life. Oh, now there are plenty of people who have had worse days. Oh, a parking ticket! I was gone five minutes! Oh, how could this day get any worse? Oh, my... A god. See, I told you, Stewie. You're a big, tough boy. Yes, I guess I am.
That may be, Stewie, but if I were you, I'd stay off the field. Concussions are the number one problem in football today. Recent brain scan studies have shown that brain injuries are directly linked to dementia and suicides in former players. Yet the league! You can play the music louder, but you can't silence the truth! I don't know, Joe. That's it. We're out of known diseases. Unless... All right, what this is has no name, so you can't have it. <laughs> we got him. Halloween is fun. Anyway, they even want me to do one of Tina Fey's Look How Quirky and Busy I Am credit card commercials. Wow, really? Yeah. Oh, wait, I think it's starting. I hear a piano shuffle and a clarinet. Taxi! Where to? Any pet shop that sells snakes. Somebody puking here? Yeah, last night some guy. Hey, it's you! Gotta go! Hi, can I help you? Can I press the button that moves to close? Sir, that's reserved for dry cleaners only. It's like a roller coaster ride for pants! Any calls? Your mistress called. She said she's waiting at the hotel for you. Now I'll be there as soon as I can. She said she's pregnant. Do you know if that Mexican doctor takes credit cards? He does. If you're scummy and on the go, try the new Visa Gold Card. Visa, it's everywhere you want to be. Ah, Joe, thank you so much for inviting us to your barbecue. Well, it's my pleasure, Lois. Hey, can one of you other men come over here and comment on the meat while I'm cooking it? Yeah, I got it. Oh, yeah. Oh, those are looking good. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Yeah, don't flip them too often now. You don't want to lose the juices. Yeah, yeah, coming along nicely. Oh, those are cooking just fine. Scoop that one up and put it back down in the exact same spot. All right, they're done. Time to eat. What the hell was that? I know, Cleveland, you ruined the whole podcast. Yeah, if I wanted to hear a black guy ramble like a lunatic, I'd watch Family Feud. Yeah, I mean, that was worse than an Italian guy describing someone's sexuality. Anyway, my brother Louie, he's, uh, he's a little off to the side, you know? Uh, foofy. Uh, up to the knuckle. He's a, he's a backwards mechanic. He likes to play in the dirt. You mean gay? Oh, mama! What on, Peter? Mama, Louie's not gay. He's, he's creative. What are you talking about? I'm a great driver. <laughs> Remember your trip to the Southwest? Beep, beep. Ah, oh, jeez, did I just hit that ostrich? No. Are you sure? Yeah, he's fine. Keep going. Okay, let's pick teams. I'll be a captain, and, uh, Mayor West, you can be a captain. All right, I pick you. You can't pick me. I'm a captain. No one had ever stood up to me like that before. I respected him from there on out. That's a great story, Grandpa. I didn't like it. None of my grandchildren had ever disliked one of my stories before. From then on, he was my favorite. Well, I don't like that story, Great Grandpa. <laughs> Future old people are wizards. Yeah, we could really turn this place around. Play our cards right, it could be bigger than the Apollo Theater. All right, now, next up, we got the comedy stylings of Kim Lee Sung. Give it up. How you doing tonight? So you ever notice when two black guys come in your convenience store and one go one way and one go the other way? What they doing? What they stealing? Who with me? <laughs> you stay out my store. All you stay out my store. I remember your face. So, it's weird being Japanese. Last night, my husband wanted 69. I said, why do you want beef and broccoli now? Hey, that's Chai! They've got to be here somewhere. Where's my first lieutenant? Here I am, sir. Yes, sir. Right indeed. Here indeed. Yes, I am, sir. I want you to turn this settlement upside down until you find Lady Redbush and Griffin Peterson. That fat bastard thinks he can steal my bride and get away with it? I wouldn't bet a corn farthing on him escaping. No, I wouldn't. Not a corn farthing would I bet. No, sir. 
What's wrong with you? Little wrong in the head I am from eating some bad sausages. Yes, some bad sausages that I eat indeed, sir. Yes, I did some bad sausages, ain't I? Hello, Your Majesty. I have recovered the crown jewels. Mum, may I say it's been a pleasure serving you, but I've decided to retire. We are losing interest in this conversation. It would be a wonderful cap on my career to have a knighthood. Come, come now, Holmes. You're not... Sometimes the bigger ladies take a little longer, you see. What? You've got to be kidding me. Well, that's all right, Brian. We can go to my writing spot. Brian, look at my jump. Look at my jump. Look at my jump. Whoa! This place has the best pizza and Pepsi, Brian. Did you hear me? The best pizza and Pepsi. Whoa. And now my pizza and Pepsi. <laughs> Oh, hey, Peter. Come on in. Thanks for coming by. Uh, no problem, buddy. Here, I brought you something. I figured anyone living alone with 73 cats needs to have a double XL Minnie Mouse sweatshirt. Thank you so much. This won't fit at all. It's perfect. So how's it going? Well, not bad. Got plenty of company. Well, that's good. I haven't seen you at the clam. Well, I've been pretty busy. So can I get you something to drink? Sure. What do you got? Well, I've got water with cat hair in it. Eh, anything else? I've got lemonade with cat hair in it. Uh, kind of a summer drink. Anything else? Oh, sure. Cat hair ginger ale? Nope. Cat hair iced tea? Uh, again, summer. You want to just take a look in the fridge, see what I got? Sure. Someone just had kittens in my mouth. Welcome, American Johnny. We give our only best room for you. Would you like smoking or chain smoking? Uh, smoking, I guess? Yes, and how many ridiculous things would you like your toilet to do? Do you have one that goes yum, 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 yum? Ah, presidential suite. Excuse me, excuse me, sorry. Sorry, Mort, I, I hate to do this. What? What's happening? They want me in the line. But where do I go? Oh. Okay, but I still get paid for today, right? I, I wouldn't know. You need to talk to Marla. Sorry. Ooh. You okay? What do you care? Sniff and cry. That's exactly the point. My child. He's my child, and nothing matters more than his well being. Oh, God, this is going to be a Lewis story, isn't it? Game of Thrones is on, just a reminder. <laughs> Hey, dude, can you pass me a speck of spaz? Sorry, bruh, all out. You want a cube of fruish? No, I'm not into fruish. I gotta tear a laser dragon. Can I handle that? I don't know. Can you? Come, what the hell is going on? Well, it's a long shot, but so is the shouting Arab gram business. From John and Keith. Lois, I need $28,000. For what? I've decided I want to open a sushi restaurant. What do you know about sushi? I don't care about the sushi. I just want to yell at customers when they walk in the door. Irashaimase! Hajimemashite! Here comes a black guy! This is everything about this a clam. I love it. Ugh. I was just gonna, that's exactly. Hey, I, I remember, I remember, I remember when, I, I remember when. I remember when QuickTime here passed out in the in the booth, this booth, and we did stuff to him that you do t to ladies, and we, we promise we never tell you. What? To the clown. No, oh, you, what? Your hair looks stupid. All all the greatest all the greatest moments of my life I spent right here in the, in this booth. Maggie's first word, Bart jumping that canyon, Mister Plow. All the greatest moments of my life. Why is, why is label guy trying to punch me? Punch you first, label guy. I gotta go pee. I don't, I don't want to get up. Joe, where's the, that thing? Where's the thing? Where's the catheter thing? No, it's mine. It's private. Hey, what happens if I blow in this end? No, it will explode. I'm gonna. You do it better than Bonnie. It takes a man to know what a man likes. 
Oh, hi, Bonnie. What's up? Hi, Lois. Um, I hate to bother you, but I'm going out of town for a few days to visit my father in the hospital. I was hoping that while I was gone, you could look in on Susie and Joe. And go have sex with Quagmire. Quagmire. Oh, shucks. You can't blame a guy for trying. Giggity, giggity, giggity. <laughs> Hey, what's that in there? That's a sensory deprivation room that prepares our astronauts for the terrifying emptiness of space. Oh, cool. Hey, come on, Brian. Try it with me. Ah! Things got crazy so fast! You want to know what kind of person Glenn Quagmire is? You want to know what made me the person I am? Then put me on the stand! Lois, can I play Angry Birds on your phone? Okay, but only with the sound off. Fine, I'll just do it with my mouth. <laughs> Oh, damn it. Dude, bad news. You're dead. What? But I'm deaf. Sorry, dude. Super deaf. You're done. So what now? I go to heaven? Nope. When a deaf dies, he gets reincarnated. You're being reincarnated as a Chinese baby right now. Girl? Girl. Sorry, but according to this map, you're not even part of these United States. Which would make you... A COMMUNIST! Ah! Ah! Ow! Damn! Usually my malcontents are skinnier. Would you come back in a week when my fat malcontent trapdoor will be completed? I'm not coming back in a week or ever. I've had it with you and I've had it with this whole damn government. Fine. I love this job more than I love taffy. And I'm a man who enjoys his taffy. Mmm. Ooh. Mmm. Oh. Mm. 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 Hey, 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 watch out, party people. Ah, oh, what the hell are these things? Curtains or something? Boring. Holy smoke, it's crowded in here. Hey! There, oh, that's terrific. That opens up the whole room. Peter, there you are. Where the hell have you been? I've been worried sick. Oh, so I had a few Red Bulls, drove to New York. What's a big deal? Hey, here's my little man. <laughs> hey, Meg, come here. Have a seat. Dad, what are you doing? Meg, I'm a redneck, which means I am about to do something to you that you will not remember until you're 40. <laughs> Meg, come back here. I meant sex. Oh, hiya, Brian. All right, Peter, now I know your head is still a blank slate, but you gotta listen to me when I say... Wait, did you just call me Brian? Oh, yeah. You've got your memory back? Uh-huh. Happened yesterday on my way back from the grocery store. Hi, Peter. Hey, you just snubbed me in front of my own house. I thought we'd come to an understanding. Look, fella, I don't know who you are, and I don't want to, so why don't you just go back to your crabgrass? This happens to be fresh marathon sod! <laughs> Oh, man, I just got my memory back. And as I recall, I don't really care for you. Wait a minute, who are you? Hey, I know you. What's your beef, stranger? Well, if it isn't my old nemesis. Previously on Family Guy. Dad's working for the Trump White House? Uh, hey, Stewie, can we do that again? Maybe a little more energy? Uh, no. I, I think we can use it. Oh, yeah, that's awesome. Wow, Stewie, that was beautiful. Did you write that? No, but can you tell me who did? Log on now. <laughs> All right, let's tally up those responses. Wow. You know who that is? You know who Thornton Mellon... First of all, it was Henry David Thoreau. But do you know who Thornton Mellon is? That was Rodney Dangerfield's character in Back to School. You feel good about yourselves? Huh? This is why the other countries are beating us, you know. So, you know, you've got only yourself to blame next time you go to the vet and complain that that Indian doctor is too rough with your cat. Oh, which way the horse goes? Ah! Why is that guy laughing at me and where is he? There was a time limit? Nobody told me that. Ah! Time for a good door, bad door. Wait, how bad is the bad door? Grandpa son, how bad was the bad door? Not too bad. But shortly afterwards, I was almost eaten alive by an escalator. Mm. The game is still going on? Oh, ho, ho, ho. you lose, Jess! Ow, 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 ow. All 
right, Peter. It's time to master the game of chess. Okay, that shouldn't be too hard. No. You will do it in the traditional Japanese way. On a wacky game show while a beautiful woman beats your scrotum with a reed. Ow! I don't know! We begin with a 100-meter dash for people afraid of yellow tape. It's anybody's race now, Tom. And it's Odai Mutombo of Kenya. All right, here's your Mike and Ikes with all the Ikes taken out. I hope you were careful, because I swear to God, if I find one Ike in there, I am going straight to Babs. It's fine, I double-checked. Here's your Mikes. What's next? Next, I want you to fly to France and tell French people that a good-looking, depressed guy smoking a cigarette is not a movie. <clears throat> people of France! A good-looking, depressed guy smoking a cigarette is not a movie. And your sirens sound like gay guys having a threesome. Well, this is where Meg was staying. Oh, I thought Paris would be a bit more picturesque. Instead, it's just traffic and some big guy using a jackhammer. But, monsieur, this is not a jackhammer. It is a jackhammer. Oh. <laughs> now, if you'll excuse me, I have some death to defy. Wow, this is just like what happened with Matthew Broderick, except no one's dead. Hey, Joe. Good morning, Peter. I'm here to revoke your driver's license. What? Why? We got reckless driving, disturbing the peace, plus the driver of one of those other cars was a virgin whose hymen was busted by the airbag, so rape. Okay, well, I guess you can take my license. Of course, it's all the way up here. Peter, knock right it here, off. Joe. Give it to right me. Here. Here Give me the officer. damn license. Well, don't you want it? This is yeah. in poor taste, yeah. Peter. You're starting there? to yeah. piss me well, off. You do You're starting take. to piss right. me right. off! Ah! Some show. Lois, those men showed me the way to an identity I've been searching for my whole life. I am gonna do everything a redneck is supposed to do. Ugh, this is gonna be more painful to watch than when he ate half a fudgesicle in one bite. Oh boy, a fudgesicle! <laughs> what? Single-handedly? Officer Swanson, as thanks from a grateful city, please accept the Certificate of Merit. And with that, I hereby declare this hero cop open. Whoa, sweet bod. You lift, bro? I've heard all I need to hear to make a decision. If you ask me, neither of these beers is wholly original. They're both pale imitations of my favorite beer, Bud Rock. Oh! Ooh. But rendering a verdict is something I'm paid to yabba dabba do! Yeah. And I find in favor of Duff! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Hello? Uh, hey, I'm, I'm in the wrong Springfield. Now, you guys don't know nothing about staying up late. I used to pull all-nighters when I worked for that lesbian carpet cleaning company. Lesbians have regular carpets, too, you pervs. When you're done with that, can you help me plug the hole in this dike? I'm kind of a jack-of-all-trades. Hey, help me fix this gash. Somebody's been having scissor fights on this thing. Okay, all right, last one across the highway to Applebee's has to pay. You got a cross at the light! Shut up! What did you say? Oh, we doing this? We doing this? You're damn right we are. Watch out, I got God on my side. I will f kill you. Man, Epcot nailed Asia. <gasps> American Johnny. Holy crap, Quagmire, you're famous here. It's American Johnny. American Johnny is back. I take a picture with the giant Samsung phone. Giant Samsung phone is also a tiny Kia car. I got a story about a fat guy who's starving and bored. 
Look, Peter, if you're that hungry, go down to the dock and find Daddy, and we'll get dinner started. You're not going to get dinner started. She's going to tell that sloppy old Spanish maid to do it. And she will, but only because she needs money to pay for medicine for her prematurely overweight son, Diabito. Mama, may I have cookie? No, Diabito. Roll back to kitchen. Oh. Pizza for Adam West. No, you gave me Canadian bacon instead of bacon? This misdeed cannot go unpunished. Pizza delivery man, prepare to meet your maker at the hands of my cat launcher. Hey, look! Somebody tried to break into the dirty movie store! Quick, grab as many as you can before someone sees us! Damn, I lost them! All right, cats, back in the bag. Come on, Fluffy. Come on, Mittens. Come on, Paul. What a ridiculous name for a cat! Paul! That's a person's name! A person's name! <laughs> oh, Paul. Dad, what's wrong with you? Why are you acting like such a bully? Because there are two kinds of people in this world, Chris. There are bullies and there are nerds. And there are hot Asian chicks. They'll do what you want. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. You better believe it, buddy. They will do what you want. Because they know. They know what you want. Oh, 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 don't be afraid. Don't be afraid. I won't hurt you. I won't hurt you. Me, big American man. My point being that I'm a bully, not a nerd. Now, where was I? Oh, yeah. Dad! Get away from me! Uh -oh. Dad! Peter's fired! You're coming to get you! Peter's fired! You're coming to get you! Here comes Peter's fired! You're coming to get you! Oh, in the kitchen, Meg! All right, you guys like impressions? Here's that guy Bob from Bob's Burgers. Hi, I'm Bob from Bob's Burgers. How about that show, Archer? You watch that show, Archer? Here's that guy, Archer. Hi, I'm Archer from that show, Archer. Now, what if those guys met? Hey, Archer. It's Bob. Hey, Bob. It's Archer. Thank you. What is this? Oh, what was I worried about? Ah, 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 oh, God! Ah, ah. He's bleeding, man! He's bleeding, and nobody's doing anything about it! I'll tell you what the news of the world is! We're in a lot of trouble! Well, I've still got to do a little work on it. What's it called? Susie. Wow, a song named after a girl. There aren't a million of those already. Name 20. Rosanna, Roxanne, Michelle, Allison, Sarah, Angie, Brandy, Mandy, Gloria, Cecilia, Maggie Mae, Jessica, Nancy, Barbara, Ann, Billie Jean, Layla, Lola, Polly, Helena, Jenny from the Block. Name six more. Sherry, Laura, Wendy, Maria, Peggy Sue, Minnie the Moocher. Name five more. Tracy, Jean, Jane, Mary Ann, Eleanor Rigby. Go f*** yourself. Oh, my God. I just drove. Dude, that was amazing. I can drive. Now I can do a slow cruise past my ex-girlfriend's apartment. 11.45 and the lights are on. Doing it with the lights on now, whore. Don't mind looking at his body. I love you so much. Killed him? That was not me. Someone else got to him first. Tough break, Jew Mouse! Ha ha! Hi, I'm Peter Griffin. Under parody law, in order to use someone else's character in an unlicensed fashion, we have to provide something called commentary. The commentary here is that Mickey Mouse hates Jews. Now, let's see what else this new nanny has up her sleeve. Yeah, where's Peter? Oh, he went to get plastic surgery. He did? Yeah, Korea's the plastic surgery capital of the world. Nobody here thinks you look good unless you have big round eyes and a tiny little nose and chin. Hey, guys. Peter, are you all right? You know what? I feel good. I feel like I want to giggle behind my hand at a lot of things and hold but not eat a big ice cream cone. Oh, right, right, let's go. We're never 
never gonna get up there. I wonder what's causing all this traffic. Oh boy, yep, there's the problem. Not drawn yet. Come on, guys, really? Let's go! What the hell's going on up there? Come on, guys, this is trespassing and it's against the law. Maybe we should just let the clam go and, I don't know, spend more time with our families. Yeah, I tried that. I just spent most of the time testing Chris to see if he's autistic. <laughs> Not overly affectionate. Everyone has fingernails and everyone wants cash. So send us all your fingernails and we'll send you some cash. Fingernails for cash.com. Fingernails for cash. Remember, it's just fingernails, so don't expect much cash. Fingernails for cash.com. Our service never fails. Just take the cash and don't ask why we want your fingernails. Because we might be building a fort with them. Fingernails for cash.com. You get the cash, we get to build a fort with your fingernails. Hey guys, how about a little TV? We can watch a baby thing together. Baby Einstein, Muppet Babies. Uh, what's CSI Babies? What's this? They can't solve this crime, they're just frightened babies. They don't even know it's a crime, they just know their parents aren't there. They're scared, now I'm scared. Turn this off! Ah, that's not what I want! Ah, I'm gonna go hide in my couch fort! Is CSI Babies over yet? Wow, Meg is going to the Olympics. Let's celebrate by burning our lips on vending machine hot chocolate. Ow. Ow. Mine has whipped cream, so I didn't get it on the first sip. Ow! Mr. Superman, no here. Oh, uh, well, we're looking for a missing... I know. Uh, Mr. Superman, he, he no is here. Yeah, okay. Well, uh, can you just give him this flyer? I know. No. no. I have no money. Just take this flyer, and if you see this baby... No, no. Out of my way, Peter. Me and my new friends are gonna go surf gliding and try to somehow work a mountain bike in there. You've changed, Joe. Like I did when I went through puberty. Hey, you guys feel like playing some baseball? Excuse me, I'm gonna go masturbate. All right, what better place to find God than the birthplace of all of Western civilization's great religions and one really mean one? I had a feeling this is what this place would be like. Oh, God, Why it's is so there never hot any out? parking downtown? Who gets married on a get off these bad feet? Ailments. Oh, look, Joe's feeding them pennies. Oh, oh? Somebody take a picture. I can't believe we didn't find God in Jerusalem. Well, we'll have to keep looking. Oh, here's our bus to the airport. <laughs> wow, that was super loud. Hey, you know, we should drive up there and use that car to eat for free. That's a great idea. Let's go to Harvard. Oh, I don't know, you guys. We'll be as out of place there as a black guy in Sweden. <gasps> black and sipping. Yeah, black and sipping. Oh, oh, I want to do one. This is better than a spin class where the instructor is just two giant Swedish legs. <laughs> Congratulations! 80% of success is just showing up! The other 20% is super loud five-year-old Coldplay songs! Yeah! Who's ready to puke at 5 a.m.? Yeah! yeah. Huh, this is great! Peter, where are you? I'm a spin class bicycle seat. <laughs> oh no! The one middle-aged post-gastric bypass guy! He didn't clean these shorts from last class! Thanks for having us over. Yeah, it's a wonderful dinner. And on this beautiful new china, you guys have a lot of new stuff. Yeah, Lois has been splurging her ass off. Yeah, she has. You know, she bought me something yesterday, but uh, I'm not going to tell you what it is. I want you to guess. So just cl close your eyes. Oh! Oh! It's a shocker horn! I know what it is! Okay, you all remember the plan. We walk up wearing our Bill Cosby masks. Peter, that's President Obama. Oh, did I just do a racism? Wow.
Well, I haven't seen Meg this happy since that bus broke down in front of our house. <gasps> Hi, can we use your phone? Holy crap, it's the children of the corn! All right, you guys like impressions? Here's that guy Bob from Bob's Burgers. Hi, I'm Bob from Bob's Burgers. How about that show Archer? You watch that show Archer? Here's that guy Archer. Hi, I'm Archer from that show Archer. Now, what if those guys met? Hey, Archer, it's Bob. Hey, Bob, it's Archer. Thank you. Um, looks like somebody's hungry. All right. Dad? Are you gay? What? Are you gay, Dad? No, Glenn, I'm not gay. Just, just tell me the truth. I am telling you the truth. Now calm down, you're ruining this ball. You know how much I love balls. All right, come on now, that's not helping. Son, you have my word, I am not gay. You promise? I promise. All right, I believe you. But I am a woman trapped in a man's body. And while I'm in Quahog, I plan to have a sex change operation. Oh, come on, just be gay. Newsing on the couch. Too late! Hey, careful, Quagmire. Don't, don't get too close to that thing. <laughs> the hell, did I just get laid? Hey, if I could rearrange the alphabet, I'd put you and I together. <laughs> hey, you must be a parking ticket, because you got fine written all over you. <laughs> hey there, I don't want to come between you. Or do I? <laughs> oh, that's awful. That's awful. This house. Yeah, you're overreacting, Lois. And you can't spell overreacting without ovary. Because you're a girl. I'm not overreacting. Hey, uh, just an FYI, uh, really no reason to go into any greater detail than this. Uh, Stewie should probably never use this pacifier again. Okay, so I'll talk to him tomorrow? <laughs> Great to see you back in your element tonight, surrounded by semen. <laughs> Seaman. See, Quagmire, I told you he's gay. Shut up, Peter. Hey, you Dan's boy? That's right. Your dad was very brave back in Southeast Asia. He flew supplies in where others wouldn't dare to go. I can't tell you how many loads your dad took when I served with him. Huh? What the hell? I killed you! I choke myself every day, you bastard. I don't know, fellas. I think there's potential in this crowd. <laughs> hey, honey, why don't you turn around and show me the Lower East Side? <laughs> sure. Whoa, transvestite, back off. Wait a sec, pre-op or post-op? Pre-op. Whoa, transvestite, back off. To the drunken clam, boys, where they don't ask for proof of age and neither do I. Quagmire, you forgot to say, oh. Are you sure? Well, I, th I think I did. All right, well, just be safe. Oh! So, do you guys just not do the anal probe anymore? Is that... No, nah, that's more or less been retired. I see, I see. D do you still have the thing? Who else but Quagmire? He's Quagmire, Quagmire. You never really know what he's gonna do next. He's Quagmire, Quagmire. Giggity, 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 let's have sex. Let us forever remember this beautiful young woman, taken from us in the bloom of youth yet as unspoiled as when she was born. Oh, that was great. Thanks. I know you have a choice in airport sex, and I appreciate your choosing Quagmire. Please exercise caution when standing up, as the contents of your vagina may have shifted during coitus. All right, I got a plane to catch. Say, which gate is flight 209? 209? That flight left half an hour ago. Oh, my God. Oh, my God! That plane's going down! My friends are on that plane! They're all gonna die! What? Oh, no! And that's not the worst part. Here's the condom I said I put on. <laughs> Aren't I just the worst? Now that we've learned the basics, this may be kind of messed up, but am I the only one getting a boner right now? Is there anything that doesn't give you a boner, Glenn? People who use the word rubbish when they mean garbage. Really? Yep, not even a wiggle down there. Your shows will appear on my playlist. May I help you? Yes, 1950s doctor. Me and my friends are looking for- Your friends with a Negro and a cripple? This man is insane. Take him away. 
Now, wait a second. You can't do that to him. A Negro speaking up to a white person? This man is insane. <laughs> now, look, I don't think... All cripples are insane. Euthanize this man. <laughs> Something I can help you with? Yeah, you got any brain-dead women in there you let people have sex with for a few bucks? Sure, come on back. You're ready, ready to enjoy, enjoy the full range of exciting DirecTV programming options. And remember, for answers to any questions you may have, you can consult the on-screen help menu, or 24-hour online assistance is available at www.directtv.com forward slash help. So sit back and enjoy DirecTV. Thanks for joining us. Welcome to the DirecTV help channel. Your destination for getting started with your new DirecTV system. Fuck, 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 fuck! Aha! Look, Brian! This trail of used tissues should lead us right to Mort. Or to Quagmire. <laughs> Ooh, he's gross. Welcome to the inner vault. Penile identification required. Let me handle this. That's amazing! How the hell did you match it? Oh, I didn't match the shape. I just stuck it in there and broke it. Glenn, thank you so much for helping me tear up my carpet. Well, you know, Lois, I, I gotta confess, uh, when you called me, I sort of misunderstood what you were asking for. That's why I rushed over, but, uh, it's, well, well you know, it's, it's fine. It's fine. Whatever. I'm, I'm happy to help. What the hell is this? Peter, I've had it with all your shocking. Uh, since you won't get rid of those pajamas, I'm getting rid of the carpets. Hey, uh, Lois, you want me to leave a little strip in this thing? Maybe a lightning bolt, unicorn, something like that? No, I want it all gone, Glenn. All right, we're going Brazilian. He's clean. Well, looks like that's it, except for the flight crew. <laughs> hey, Brian, what's with the Johnny Law routine? Say hello to our newest narc. He's a natural. Oh, yeah? How, how good are you? You're back from Manila. You had lumpia for dinner. Then you made love to two Filipino women. And a man. You mean three Filipino women? No! Hey, guys. Well, it's been great to meet you all, and I'm looking forward to getting to know you while we're here. <sighs> Dude, put your pants on! Shut up! Glenn, I wouldn't miss this night for the world. Everyone here admires your dad. He'd walk into an army barracks and make every private there feel important. Yeah, he just knew how to stroke those privates. Oh, God. Your dad was cock of the walk, Glenn. Every day at rifle training, he'd help me clean my butt. Your dad once drank me under the table. If there was one man you wanted in your hole, it was your dad. Your dad had the best penis in the military. Okay, just stop! Stop! Everybody stop! Oh, wow, I can't even imagine what twisted deviant act you've thought of this time. I want you to have sex with your father. What? Yep, and I'm gonna watch. Hi, Glenn. Are you crazy? No! No way! Glenn, remember, the thing we love most about each other is that we push each other way beyond our normal boundaries. Did you enjoy your stay at the Marriott? No, I did not. Peter, what the hell? My car! We buy it! Oh, damn it! Hey, hey, come back! 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 Hey, Hey, listen, I, I really want to thank you guys for taking me in in my time of need. Oh, forget it, Quagmire. It's the least we could do after what happened. H Hello? Oh, you must have a wrong number. There's no one here by the name of Long Rod Von Hugendong. Oh, sorry, Quagmire. How the hell am I supposed to get to the airport? I gotta fly a plane in 20 minutes. Oh, I can drive you. I got a pickup truck, see? Well, come on! Quagmire, I am so sorry. Don't worry about it. We can go after them. Don't worry about it. They're tagged. They're tagged. Just get me to the airport. We're going too fast. We're going to crash into that lake. Oh, no, we're not. <laughs> oh, yeah, right there. That's good. And now to discharge the plane's fire retardant. Giggity. Yeah, Brooke, what do you say we get you some more champagne? Sure. <laughs> All right. Oh, uh, hey, <laughs> forgot about you guys. <laughs> well, <laughs> I guess the <your> date's over. <laughs> Good night, Brooke. Thanks for a lovely evening. Ah. <laughs> uh... 
Hi, Glenn. Uh, hey, will you sign a petition to overturn Mayor West's ban on gay marriage? Gay marriage? Ah, oh, come on. Two halves can't make a hole without a hole. Giggity, 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 giggity. Ooh, ee, ooh, ah, ah, ting, tang, walla, walla, bing, bang. Ooh, ee, ooh, ah, ah, ting, tang, walla, walla, bing, bang. Glenn, would you feed Mittens? Mittens has food in his bowl. That's old food. Mittens, shut up. Mittens, shut up! Don't you talk to Mittens that way! Mittens is a member of this family! Mom, you want this three-way to happen, you're gonna have to change your tone. Now, Meg, in order to get you into fighting shape, I want you to drink this glass of raw eggs. I don't see any yolks. Just drink it. All right, Meg, remember what I taught you. Relax my throat and make eye contact? No, no, the fighting stuff. Package for Glenn Quagmire. Oh, uh, excuse me. Nice try, but I built up an immunity. Nice figure eight, Mom. <laughs> All right. Oh, hello. Ow! That feels great. There's a naked lady squatting over a cake in your kitchen. She'll wait. She she knows to wait. Would you just sit down and go to the bathroom already? 